One of the most lucrative collections people have is that of cars. We love to hear about the collection of our favorite celebrities, so what kind of epic collection do car builders and enthusiasts like Martol have? We are sure that he has a whole garage full of eccentric cars, which may have increased in uniqueness and value by modifying them with his crazy ideas. Sadly, though, it does not seem like we've been able to get a close enough look inside his garage and car collection. Over the years, Toll has been seen driving many exotic cars and also features them daily on his social media posts. We cannot be sure if he is showing off his collection or the projects he has undertaken at the Gotham Garage. However, the car master's rush to riches star has a few iconic cars we know that he owns and loves to drive. The two of those iconic rides are Gothic late 60s Mustang. Mustangs are the most sought cars among collectors, and the cars from the 60s in particular are the best of the best. So of course, Toll would own one. Most people do not like to mess with this car with many modifications though, but Toll isn't most people. He had a solid new design installed on the car with the same gothic theme we've seen him do countless times in the show. He painted the car in bulging black with a dash of red here and there. He put a spider web front grille to complete the evil look and a gothic emblem in red to complete the look. He has put slightly bigger tires and rims as well. Every modification and redesign he made to the car was aggressive, but it strangely works. Flipco. People say that the age of automobiles is long and over, and it may be true considering how no one makes coast trucks anymore. Fortunately, many people got to see what a co is and how cool it can be when Mike Toll brought it in the Gotham garage and kept it for himself for a long time. Toll renovated and modified the truck from junk himself. Hot car states it was Ford or Chevrolet, but can't specify the exact day. As it sits now, it looks more like a painted slab of American iron with one wheel at each corner. Hot Cars explained, the bed is handmade of wood as is the rear trunk that sits behind the bed. Indeed, Tell opted to paint it to look like it was rusted to give the vintage look with dashes of black silver and red here and there and flames below it over the window pane. The interior was a beautiful red leather finish and spiderweb accents on exterior trim pieces. Because it wouldn't be a Mark Toll project without spider webs. Tell has since repainted the truck to a more elegant white and orange pattern and reportedly sold it for around $80,000. However, it still remains one of his most iconic cars. What is Mark Toll's net worth? We may not have Mark Toll's full list of cars that he owns and drives here, but we are sure he must be able to afford a car collection of millions of dozens of automobiles. We don't know that Mark Toll's net worth has been estimated to be around $250,000 to $300,000, so yes, he can afford a collection like that.